Hey there, howdy folks, T-Rev here. We're revving it up, fired up and excited. I have a little bit of a challenging topic for us today, and that is the wilderness, being in the wilderness. I, um, I've really been going through suffering uh, with Christ, for Christ, uh, uh, which is a high calling, and he's been talking to me about that. And I want to remind us all that right after Jesus got baptized, that it was actually the Holy Spirit that led Jesus into the wilderness. Sometimes we'd like to think that the wilderness is created by the enemy, uh, opposing us, trying to challenge us, creating situations and circumstances. But I want to uh, remind all of us that it's actually God that may have led you into the wilderness in order for you to come out in power, in order for you, for us to come out in strength, in order for us to see miracles. Because we come out of the wilderness, like it says in Song of Songs, chapter 8, verse 5, we come out of the wilderness leaning on our beloved. It says, who is that that comes out of the wilderness leaning on her beloved. Why I would propose, does it say who? Because we go into the wilderness looking one way and we come out looking a whole nother way. And so if you find yourself in the wilderness, I would encourage you to stop putting your focus on trying to get out as much as trying to see God in it, worship God in it, find God in it, because he's there, he's with you, and he's bringing to you, you to a whole new level of trust in him. And as I said before, this is a year of renewal. 2018 is a year of renewal. And so we're coming out. If you're in the wilderness, you're coming out fresh, new, full of power, and ready to do and perform miracles on the Lord's behalf. God bless you. I look forward to talking to you again tomorrow.